Okay, I want to check the wolf. Yep, that guy is running. Why is everyone running? Welcome back my friends to another episode of 7 days to die modded. We are playing what Rizek on alpha 19. Let's continue from where we left off and we didn't left off at the beginning screen, at the starting screen, but we are going to start again. Why? Because I was while playing, well, after playing episode number one, I was starting to record episode number two and we have a new version of War Rizek and has expected uh, the version 1.2, which is the one that I am playing right now. The first episode, it was 1.1. It, re it required a restart. So today, uh, today's episode, it's going to be like a Groundhog Day. And I, it's a reference to a very known movie, old movie, I'm getting old, which was in that movie, uh, the main character of the movie, he got to uh, live the same day all over again. So we are going to play day one again. We are going to play day one again. We are. Did I spawn at the, at the exact same spot? I don't know. Let's well. We it it is it is easy to know. Let's just get the plant fibers going. Get the rock, and I'm going to place the bedroll. Bedroll. I'm playing in the same exact map with the same exact settings. What the hell is that? A burning boar. Bedroll. There you go. Let me get an extra bedroll. The game. Oh, okay, sure, sure. Uh, the game it, it is a lot tougher. I did get several barrels on the first episode, so let's lay low. Let's not start, start shooting everything, but then I know that I will get into trouble. I'm playing on warrior difficulty, I don't have any kind of armor, so just a couple of mechs to the face and I will be in trouble. So look at the, the trader, 600 meters, we are here, where is the trader? Okay, down there, we can do it, and the class, I'm going to the, again, I haven't checked yet the the other one, so I will go again to the rifleman. Craft. Feel free if you know. I will try to see if there is any link, but feel free if you know uh, the contents of other classes to leave a comment below. Open. There you go. Baseball bat. Yeah. A rifle and a magnum. When when a when a game gives you this kind of weapons at the beginning, you have to suspect suspect that it's going to be tough. Let me reload and let's lay low and try to reach the trailer because I will get into trouble easily. And another battle going. Come on bedroll. Should I craft? Well I might, right? It It is a, a kind of a protection so let's Okay, and this update, the update that we are playing, what the f... Come on, come on, don't you do this to me, why do I see, why am I seeing a burning dog? Most of my games, uh, uh, I, I am starting the games by running away from, from, from something. How many stones? I need more stone. A big chicken. Big chicken. That guy. Even if if it looks funny, shouldn't attack me. I craft a pair of gloves, a hood, pants, shirt, and some shoes. There you go. It would be looking beautiful. Can I get some stones? Okay, let's go. Let's uh, let's try to ignore. If I start shooting these dudes or some meat, I will attract all the zombies around. I don't want to do that. Oh, 
and there are plenty of ferals. Might be a bug, right? All of these ferals. Load. Let's go to the trader. Unlock the, unlock the quests. It's moving. So this 1.2 update. We have um, snake. Can I kill the snake with with the baseball bat? Want to die, snake, right? There you go. So let's get a stone axe going. If we are, if we are silent, it'd be okay. So I craft a bow. I never I never use the bow in uh, War Prisac, but it's a little bit more silent silence than shooting weapons, waking up or attracting everyone everyone around. Search giant snake. You are not giant, my friend. Meat. Empty giant snake. Okay, let's keep moving. Let's keep saving our stamina. I was even thinking that I that I somehow did uh, didn't change my settings of my streams. We are playing uh, uh, in my streams uh, insane nightmare game vanilla. <laughs> Really? Oh, really? Look at this. The zombies went to my spot over there. Can we go over here? Use. Are they running? Okay, I want to check the wolf. Okay, yep, that guy is running. Why is everyone running? This, this is clearly what happened to me on my first or, or on my test game. Nice. Come on. Let's check, uh, let's check the wolf because you can search the wolf. Nothing amazing. Bombs. No. See a zombie over there. And most of the zombies, they are running. Come on, rest. No knife. No more shenanigans. Let's quickly get to the trader. I can't cry at the trader. Come on, bone chief. I might... The... the... The warrior settings might be a little bit too much. I knew that I get, I would be getting, be getting these guys, these ferals from day one. A lot of ferals. Probably I wouldn't have selected warrior. But we are playing on warrior, so as you have seen, just one smack to the face, and I go down. My health goes down like there's no tomorrow. Literally, like there's no tomorrow. Where is the trader? Uh, 200 meters. Okay, stripper. Is it the stripper that runs? Or you want, or you are a, a regular stripper. It looks like it's, it has a lot of health. But it looks like it's a regular stripper. The good part is you kill them with a baseball bat. And they don't attract friends. Let's keep watching for wildlife also. It, for me, it has been a long time before I started a new work. Like, 
was one of my longer playthroughs on Alpha 18. So uh, the the start, it was a long time ago. So really, I might have missed a lot of updates and a lot of tweaks. I'm not going to shoot those because I will wake up zombies. I am not ready to be fighting. Oh, look at this! We have found our house again. It's clearly Groundhog Day. But I think we are not in the same. And of course, Groundhog Day with also a spider zombie. Come on, game. Let's not get distracted. But I don't think that we are in the same house, in the same, uh, in the same town. Or are we? We might. We might. I think it's the same town. Yep, it is. The, it is the, exactly exactly the same town. And we, we did start. Okay, so weird. Yeah, but I am using the same map, so that might be the reason why we are in. Um, why the, the the starting place it's the same, but usually each map uh, they have different spawning points. I think. Okay, let's see if we are that lucky again. Destroyed, I don't remember. And destroyed. Oh, but nice. Problem solved. Barrel. Yep. Not that lucky. Okay, nice. Chest armor. Where? Uh, military purify tablets, uh, press boy cap mod, and some blender bus ammunition. Nice. Okay, and then another thing that I did forget to speak with you guys. Oh, nice. HD AK 33. Use a retra retracting stock and the wooden club. Uh, to unlock extra uh, lots on, the, on your backpack. You can use the pack mule, but the, the pack mule gives you the exact same slots unlocked like vanilla. So each point in pack mule it will give you four slots. I think it's four or three. So if you if you go into the perk, the four points, you will unlock another row. Extra rows, you need to find a special backpack that you can only loot to unlock extra rows. And let's check the trader again. I am. We have 11 wood. But, yep. I am a little bit uh, sad that I that I didn't um, that I didn't get more wood because now I have zombies all around and I need wood for wood frames and whatnot. That's Welcome to Trader Joe's. First. Don't guarantee a thing, First. except that I don't like you. Okay, drops. Uh, how about a fetch 42 meters to the east? This is what I talk about. This is a, a great quest. It is a quest for the building next door. There you go. Well, come to think of it, there you go. What are you standing there for? Good, 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 good. Don't you have so, an inventory? To do. So, inventory. Uh, Charger chassis, a SWAT helmet, Magnum, a grave digger mod, sledgehammer, more bullets, an M M60 machine gun, very expensive, rockets, and pretty much it. Okay. Flashlight, a lot of wood, wooden bow, and we are getting all the quests. And probably with version 1.2, we are going to get get the cook class also quests. That was a new addition from 1.1 to 1.2. For designer, for steel, nothing. I, I will return here later. Then club. Get the hell out of my store! It's for real customers. And I, I, I would really like a, a friendlier, friendlier. Um, Trader. So, modify. No, I cannot add 
Uh, are good as you are. Let's just reload. And you, can I modify you? Yep. Retracting uh, stock mod. Extra damage. Uh, extra range. So we are going to... The same building, the same exact building. That top floor is amazing. So let's wrap recipe. This for landmines, right? Wrap. I need to get a tree. I need not to die. Be afraid, be very afraid. Getting a lumberjack. Stripper again. Please don't run stripper. Oh, and a farmer. If I start shooting, I will get all of these guys attacking me. Don't run. Tell me that you don't run. And the problem is these, these guys are so tough. There you go. Was kind of scary. Okay. Are you are you also running? Maybe. And oh, nice. Everything is fine. I get this tree. Let's place the bedroll. Don't want to walk again. Reach this spot. And we need wood frames. Let's get ten or fifteen. Okay. And. We can also check the classes. I, I, I see, I'm seeing food walking by, but I don't want to attract. Oh, and that, look at this. There is also crates on the top of the building. Can I get a secure or a chest? They're going to place it on the corner because I am encumbered. I am running. I am into a lot of trouble, as it is. Let's not make it even more tough. By fighting with a lot of junk. Yes. Good enough. Good enough. And we can now start shooting zombies in the face. And run. Well, let's... This is my version of playing or uh, my go-to tactic when playing insane nightmare settings insane in, zombies on insane and they are running on nightmare speed so let's get something like this if I get surrounded I will run over there if I need to start shoot these dudes and do that Come on, be loud. Seven days to die, 101. Never forget. Did I get the turn? I think most of the zombies, the ferals, are um, zombies from the wildness. The, the ones that are inside the house. I'm glad that I did. I did check this corner. The dog is down. I haven't. I haven't seen yet spiders. Come on! I don't have the whole day. Let's. While you think about life. can sneak on some of 
Any zombies? Nice. Can come up instead of trying to break. Wow, 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 wow. I knew, I knew it. I knew it. These, these stairs over here, they are, they are the bane of my existence. Ooh. A minion. Come on, minion. Okay, we can use it. Okay, and I think we have secured the house. Well, well we have cleared the house. Let's double check. Hello? Dead body over there. The doors are still on one piece. Anyone inside over there? Let's let's spend a little bit of time making sure that everything is okay. So just the bathroom. Now I can even look it quickly. I want to loot everything on the bottom floor and move everything up, like I did on the, on the last episode, again. Okay, the poster, it's, it was an Harry Potter and now it's this one. So it's better. And let's go up again. Anyone inside over here? On this balcony? Let's, let's see. Hello? But we can go up. There is some boxes up there. Okay. Let's again. Again on, on 1.2. Do it all over again. Mm -hmm. So we did craft some secure chests. Get this one going. Another dog. The the lumberjack it's walking the dog. And let's let's not be encumbered. Here, but everything else. Bullets stay with me. Uh, contact grenade, let's read you. I'm going to use contact grenades. I, I will have to shoot them. I will have to do it. Ooh. Dog is down. And the lumberjack. Is he just walking? If he is, he gets the... Um, like it is. He gets the, the, the baseball club to the face. Well, he's walking faster, right? There you go. Keep a nice distance. Yeah, but he, he is faster. No, 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 no. You cannot start running. You cannot walk and then decide to run. That's against the rules. Bring everything up. Let's start looting also. I will place. Let me see if I can make uh, some kind of blocking the way so that these guys don't go up these stairs. Usually, this kind of stuff works. Oh. We are inside. Let's loot from the bottom to the top. Oh, nice. I'm already finding the HD schematics. Go. Open. Go. Bullets. He's making the noise. Yeah. <laughs> 
Just one? Oh, come on, I can help you. I, I want to clear all of these uh, wilderness zombies. Come on. I can do it. Come on. Oh, it's the sound. Okay, it's the sound of them, of the door on the feet of the, of that zombie. Okay. At least over here, it's it's clear. Uh, let's craft more wood frames. This I will again place over here. Just even if the zombies try to go through these blocks, at least I will hear them. It's an, uh, just a kind of warning, warning sign. So let's drop what I have quickly over here and loot, let, loot, and loot the boxes. The good part is we are playing the second, the first day for the second time in the short, uh, in a short span. So that means that I am a little bit faster doing the same things. So let's. There. That means that we can check these boxes and probably split this day one in two episodes. Okay, the boxes are open. Let's check card parts. Ooh, B D BRDM chassis. And okay. I will go to the schematics at the end. Okay, nice. Oh, found the M MD500 accessories, which is a helicopter and the cruiser handlebars. Nice. Nice. Much better now than the, when we searched them in the previous episode. So that's a nice upgrade. A lot of tools. I'm going to Let's get everything and then browse on our inventory. There we go. And we have a quest on that PI just over there, so that's really nice. Let's try to squeeze that quest on, on, on the on the on the afternoon of day one. Boxes. And probably take, uh, episode number two we'll try to do that fetch quest. Uh, uh, perhaps uh, uh, harvest some resources and uh, when the night arrives, I will um, go through the, the class quests and also the skill parts. I don't want to lose any daylight if I can avoid it. So it is uh, just maximizing daylight. So before ending the episode, let's quickly check the loot. We found the HD welder schematic. I think it's something that you add to a workbench. We have the HD PIX bench schematic. That's nice. We now can craft oil. And should I keep it or sell it? I think I will sell it. Early on, I want the money. The spotlight schematic, same, the same thing. Uh, HD Vulcan, 762. Show up. This one I will read. The HD ones, I will read all of them. HD Cement Mixer schematic. Sure. And that's pretty much it. We did find, find a beaker. A lot of stone tools. Three uh, vehicles. Parts, different ones. BRDM. Two the cruiser handlebars and the MD-500. Um, some shotgun parts, rocket launcher parts, steel sledgehammer parts. If you need money, it's also something that you can sell. Get the, the money that you can get out of these parts. And that's and a little bit of food. And that's pretty much what we got. Did I leave anything on these chests that I, uh, that I should have read? Yes, I did. HD M4A1. And I think now it works. So it's good to know. Uh, all of the, all of the rest of the stuff, it's junk. Okay, my friends. A, a, a more streamlined first episode. Uh, I do hope we can now uh, move a little bit, uh, advancing a little bit in the game. But again, I will say it again. We are playing Alpha 19 Experimental. Just by itself, it might require restarts. 
and we are playing a mod that it's being changed to alpha 19 over that alpha 19 experimental so i don't mind uh Mr. Wartrizak, he has done a wonderful job on this mod, and I don't mind restarting. I understand that it might we might get restarts. I don't mind. So you guys, if you want to play or download the the mod, do so. But be aware that you might have to restart often. So if you don't mind, play it because it's a blast. Well, it's a blast, and you ha will have plenty of ferals uh, to deal with. Um, if you want something more stable, you first need Alpha 19 to reach stable and then get a, a proper, also stable release of uh, of War Trizak. But if you want some adventures, please do install this War Trizak because it is amazing. I hope you have enjoyed and I hope to see you all in the next one. Until then, thank you.